Welcome back to Let's Play Dark Souls 2. Also, I've got that dagger on. Ah. Uh, just reacquainting myself with which weapons I have. Last time, we made our way into Castle Drang Lake. Just gonna go ahead and say, this direction is off limits. Those statue guys weren't there before. Uh, it's got one of those doors that I have to have a... You spun around for that. Uh, it's got one of the doors that I have to have a certain item to open. And... As you might have guessed, I lack that certain item. And he's dead. I really like that little dagger. Okay, there you there were not statue dudes in the middle of the room last time. Oh dear. I am going to go do check a thing. I'm gonna go ahead and boost up this regular scimitar. Melu scimitar is nice, but its scaling leaves a lot to be desired. Wow. Reinforce a weapon to its limit. I'll be around. Just so you know, uh, should be slightly obvious. In Dark Souls 2, uh, plus 10 weapons are the limit instead of plus 15. If somebody gives you a plus 15 weapon in Dark Souls 2, they used a hack. There are hacks to accomplish it. Uh, I, I, there are some quirks involving it. Uh, some of them can be game crashing depending on exactly which number is used and at one point were bannable but I don't know if they actually still have the uh, system watching as closely. I don't know. Anyway, it's, it's not something I ever tampered with. I just remember reading some forum posts about it long ago. I think it was when I first got to the end of the game and realized I had not gotten a plus 15 weapon. I went and looked it up and was like, oh no, Dark Souls 2, uh, plus 10 only. But now I can do this and actually deal competent damage. But first... Okay, you're not gonna mess with me. You're, okay, they just put more of them in here to play mind games, didn't they? Oh dear. Okay, he's real. Oh, and it's the spear one. Okay, so generally be careful. When you find one that's real, wail on it a bit. Don't run away like I did. And you get an easy kill like that. Okay, and there are two golems in here. Let's see if we can get y'all up and running. I mean, they mostly just light up the room, but it's still pleasant. These two statue guys were not here before. It used to be a lot harder to, uh, to get enemies over here because there weren't that many statue guys. And you'll see what the other enemies are in a minute. I just feel like getting that dealt with first. Okay, there we go. Oh, this is much nicer. It used to be all the ones that were standing at doors were... Uh... You know, oh crud, golem doors. Now I remember... Yeah. <sighs> Basically, this room is a pain if you don't do it carefully. Ow. Case in point.
I'm just gonna keep the shield out. There's a little bit of insurance. Cause it's rare you get them to hold still long enough to hit more than once. And then he instantly holds still for me. I'm on the other side of the statue. You gotta walk around it to get to me. Yeah. Okay, that's you dealt with. Royal Soldier's Ring plus one, more carry capacity. Which I'm currently a little above my comfortable carry capacity. Because I've got the shield on so that I can uh, swap between that. Oh crud. Oh no! Run you fool! Run! 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 Come on, my Estuses are stronger than that. Where'd they go? There you are. Hey, fellas. See, the bad thing is this one came from the other door. Both of them at this door, okay. So I gotta make sure that this guy dies near this door. You really don't want to have to start this room over. Because the doors don't reclose, so the sentinels will forever be a pain. I think they're actually one of the enemies that does infinitely respawn. It makes this room great for soul farming if you have the patience for dealing with six sentinels. And all the little, little woolly boogers. Hey, 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 come over here, come over here, look, it's something interesting, it's a shiny thing. Please be close enough, yes, oh no, I just gave up 3,000 souls. Oh, that hurts. Ugh. Another good reason to make sure it's the little ones that activate that Mastodon and Greatsword. Hmm, where be you at? There, no Black Knight Halberd. Zweihander, Mastodon Greatsword. That's just a slightly bigger Zweihander. Okay. Back to the uh, warp sword. That's not a ruin sentinel. Okay. Let's go this way now. I forgot to power. Roll. Ugh. The sheer amount of stagger time is just unpleasant to me. I don't like when you get stuck in multiple hits from an enemy. And the spear users are kind of notorious. No! Notorious for it. Okay, I can make this work. Ooh, a Titanite Slam. That's that that's a good drop. I need to find out 
which ones are statues. And nope, I cannot do it without aggroing him. Naturally, he puts the shield up. The one time I want to see what it did do, and that, that was that roll was my bad. bad again. I rolled too early. I'm trying to keep a close eye on the amount of health it has because I need to use it to open that door. But I also need it to be low enough on health that if that turns out to be... That's, okay, it's not a statue. I mean, it is a statue, it's not gonna come to life statue, you know what I mean. It works to my benefit if I can get all six doors open. Now we've got the same problem again of, I, I'm assuming that one of those statues is alive. I'm afraid that both of them statues be alive. Oh, come on. Move! I know why it happens. It, it's just still aggravating. If your shield gets hit and you run completely out of stamina, it staggers you for a little bit longer. And I have Estus plus four, and they're still just not healing as much as I feel like they should be. And I'm just making stupid mistakes at this point. That's where I was hearing footsteps from somewhere other than him. That's 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 great. It's another life gem wasted. I am not very fond of the Ruined Sentinels as an enemy, to be honest. Uh, I mean, not the boss fight particularly, but dealing with six of them in here just becomes tedium. They don't stagger, they, de they don't... They, they're time sinks. Uh, partly due to the fact they don't stagger, but also to do with the fact that they just don't tend to oh well I'm lucky uh, don't tend to hold still enough for you to get more than about one hit on them. oh I'm so lucky I decided to do that it's not that they're overly difficult hello overly difficult or anything it's just they end up taking up more time I don't know how that missed me but I'll accept it And particularly because they end up being a time sink, it makes the player more likely to take risks and get a little greedy and take damage. Because you kind of just want to get it over with. I'm going to get it. Nope. Somehow I was outside of the hitbox for that. Okay. Okay. This room has been thoroughly... I never did get to go in here, did I? Feral's Lockstone. Did I go in the other room? Have I looked in these rooms? Nope. 
So this room was pointless. Uh, attribute? Concept? Pointless ahead. Well, some poor soul will not open that door and make the mistake I did. And this... That I knew was coming. Oh! You were not here before! You can backstab dooters? Well, that's a discovery for the ages. Mask of Judgment. No, I don't want to put a message. I want to see what this Mask of Judgment is. Oh, look! It's, uh... Oswald's Mask! The guy from the previous game who you would go to to be quote-unquote forgiven. Always look around before. The blood stains, man, they make me nervous. Oh, so the duder didn't come back. Does that mean that Oswald turned into a duder? Because it had Oswald's mask. And this is another location to find. Are you people trying to kill him? Like dying are those people that just avoided the duder and then forgot about the duder and died to the duder young undead don't let this curse weigh upon you we meet a second time perhaps you will yet traverse the dark <sighs> young undead if you truly seek the dark and we will surely meet again. The third meeting place is in Black Gulch. I just can't open that door yet. I probably will end up doing this covenant just to showcase it. Not one of my favorite covenants. I love the concept. It's just the fact that it costs a human effigy for every attempt and it's full of phantoms is stuff that's not pleasant. But yes, that bonfire is pretty much a dead end. There's no way to get back up into the room. There's no way in normal Dark Souls 2 to get back into that room, pending Scholar playing shenaniganry. But now this room is lit up. Those two are not statues, so that's 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 a thing. Oh, oh. Uh, <laughs> I forgot about Ruin Sentinel. Same AI as before, it won't come in here. Uh, you can kind of lure it in here if you're persistent enough, but it really doesn't want to come in here. These guys used to be a lot more prone to come in here. Maybe this whole area... Maybe they made it a safe zone to be merciful. Sentinel over there is going to be a problem. Oh, hello there. I see you hiding. I'm not dealing with you. These statues were not all here before. I'm just going to be honest. They are making me very uncomfortable. Frozen flat. Ah! I'm busy pondering. Shush. I remember the item name, Frozen Flower, but I can't for the life of me remember where it goes. And it sure, I don't remember it being found here. Are 
Are you wearing the Hexer's hood? I can't tell. Soul of a Hero, Radiant Life Gem, Monastery Charm. But yeah, these statues are new, and I have to applaud them on the design for just making this area a little more stressful than it should be. Dark arrows. <coughs> Hurrah for rolling, yes, I approve. The fact that I had to roll to get through there. I mean, to get between the chest and the statue. Oh, also, there's a weird thing to do with this chair. One of those weird things I've never had explained. There's supposedly something you could do in the castle that'll make certain chairs glow also, and I'm not really sure what's up with all of that. None of you are real. I highly doubt that, sir. Oh no. Uh, I just want a dual wield. Can you people stop being... There. Stop doing these things. Also, yes, corrosive. That's the sound of statues destatuing. You guys down here being behaved? You better be. Aha! And it poisoned him right at the end. That was not my shining moment. Just making sure all of these guys, but yeah. Any damage dealt to them makes them spit corrosion. I cannot get him out. Okay, traditionally what you do is you strip off all your items and run through the corrosion to pick up the items because there's some good items down there. At the moment, I'm not going to do that because uh, I'm cute. Hello. I'm carrying souls and there's a way to get over there to kill him if I'm patient. memories of this. What the? There was no treasure chest in this room before. That was in this room before, though. Now I don't know what their trigger is. Oh, no, they're just motion sensitive. Okay. So if I'd left the treasure chest well enough alone, I wouldn't have had to deal with them. That's great. I don't trust her. Didn't want two of you. I just wanted one of you. Yep. 
Let's hope a good stab with Mirtha's Bent Blade can finish you. Yes, it can. Okay, hello. <gasps> no, 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 no. <laughs> that works. He fell in the corrosion. <laughs> He'll be back in a minute. Maybe I can get rid of third one before he gets here. Aha! No! Okay, let's let's finish finish you before your friend gets back. Okay, that's that's plenty. I don't have to worry about you anymore. I'm just gonna ignore you now. I don't actually know if the other guy is gonna make it back up here or not. I'm just afraid that the moment I let my guard down. Just so you know. Yeah, the game is quite hinting that there's something not to be trusted about her. Ah, I'm not waiting on him anymore. There should be an invader up here. Don't get too close to the wall, the curse is annoying. There it is. Yeah, you <laughs> don't want to get trapped out there. Nope. You just jump attack with a dagger. That that's how you die. I love having that two hit. Human effigy. And beware of crossbow gremlins. That is not a good sound. Oh, that was lucky. Surprise poison! Please just back off the clip. Have you given up? I don't know why I thought I could <laughs> shield break him. People wonder why they don't trust... You wonder why people don't trust statues. Hang on, there should be a... Uh... Aha! That is a lot more statues. I don't trust y'all. Aha! Off with you. Often missed bonfire. Very easy to miss. I'm actually going to rest at it because I need my S decision back. And a little recharge from my weapon durability it never hurts either. Sploosh. There's something else I can do down there also, but... Really, sir? I just wanted to leave a message. I guess you wanted to meet Mesa's burnt blade. And yes, I mispronounced that on purpose. There you go. Leave me alone. Boop. 
Could have left me be, and you wouldn't have died. Okay, let's see. Uh, be wary of orientation. Right. And then. Bonfire? Uh, maybe be wary of ladder and then visions of object bonfire. Oh, yes, I do need down there. No, go down. Oh, you poor fool. There we go. <clears throat> now, we remember the guy that was up here shooting at me. Also, that's a beautiful shadow. Uh, I thought there was a guy here before, but okay. There's the entrance to the castle. Hunter's black. Oh, Hunter's black bow. I forgot that's where I get that. Fifteen more range, more damage, better scaling. It weighs as much as two bows, but still. Aha! Did he splash up here? Okay. I forgot I have a life hand. In any case, assuming they didn't put anything in here to kill me. At the first sign of enemy, I am fleeing. Oh, hello there! Hello there! Hello there! Hello there! Okay, there we go. Oh, come on. I got me a third one. Aha! Oh, hey, buddy. You here to join the party? I didn't have the stamina for a sustained attack there, huh? The Royal Great Sword. And that's what I call a trap. If this is a mimic, so help me. Corrosive iron. What else would you find in a sea of corrosion? Okay, well... That's that. And I don't want to work my way all the way back to the bonfire. It'd be kind of a uh, waste of time. Oh look, Hunter's Black Bow. Warped Sword. Scimitar plus three. No, I need the 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 plane. And where's the black bow? Uh, difficult to handle, requiring some amount of practice to master. Hunting goddess of Anna was no goddess at all, but rather a brave and highly skilled bow huntress. Long after her demise, the passing of lore transformed her into a deity. Twenty-five dexterity required, but a very good scaling. And now I gotta remember which rings I had on. I know the stone ring. Chlorinthy ring is a given. And what else? 
Oh, silver serpent ring. There we go. Next would be the jester's gloves. And the cat pants. Let's see. Prisoner's tatters. And we'll go with the jester's cap again. That seems to be a look that's working for me. Bye bye. You can't change items while on ladders. That should be self explanatory, but. I'm gonna go ahead and deal with Goomba up here. Backstab! Okay, there we go. Oh, you're done. Also, that bow is huge. <laughs> Bigger than I thought. Just generally be wary of statues in here. Gorgeous view, yeah, I guess it's... Uh, it's, it's a pretty nice view. Beautiful rain. Wait, no, Phantom. Isn't this where I came from? No, this is not where I came from. You have fought admirably on your journey, cursed undead. I am Nishandra, Queen of Dranglik. A true monarch carries the weight of their souls. The last king of this land, King Vendrick, as he was called, he found the strength to rule his people. And when the undead were born, cursed, he found more strength to face them. But in the end, he never took the true throne. She's mad that she couldn't get there. Visit Vendrick. And I'm not, it, it makes sense plot wise later. Anyway. We have no need for two rulers. There is an invisible wall blocking this from working, but. I have heard that there's supposedly a way to hit her through there, but I don't know if that's just, you know general rumor mill stuff. But she's not to be trusted, and this is a false. <laughs> a false. No, this is a boss wall. This is a false. We've invented a word today. Uh, yeah, not one of my favorite bosses, either. Why did I come in here with 30 souls? 30,000 souls? Twin Dragon Riders. Just be very mana conscious, I mean, stamina conscious in this fight. And never really stop moving, it makes it a lot less likely for him to hit you with an arrow. But he will join the fray if I take too long. Or when this guy reaches a certain amount of health, I'm not 100% sure. Nope. I stood still too long. I'm gonna be honest, that, that arrow dodge there was pure dumb luck. That one, I heard him fire the arrow. That one, I heard him fire the arrow as well. Oh, I heard him fire the arrow, but I didn't get my finger to the button quick enough. Oh, joy. Two Dragon Riders is more such fun. 
Estus, Estus, Estus. Yes. Yes, just to Estus. And as typical with any boss fight involving multiple targets, you're going to want to focus on taking one of them down. <laughs> and just kind of roam around the room dodging until you get them in, into a good position. I didn't account for the other one throwing a two hit at me. Had that not been a two hit combo, that would have been perfect. By the time I got into range, you'd have been ready to wind up again. And remember, as with the first Dragon Rider, do not underestimate the range on that stick of his. I wasn't trying to do a roll attack, but it worked in my favor. Because he hit me with an attack that knocked me down, it made me invulnerable to the incoming hit that was to follow. I forgot to put my uh, Pyromancy Glove back on. Uh, if they get timed up just right, you can't really do much to dodge. And I'm burning through Estus's badly. The fight gets a lot easier when you take one of them down, because then it's just old Dragon Rider. Which is exactly why there's two of them, to make it different. Oh, I rolled at the wrong time. Oh, that one was... Depending on how their attacks time up, sometimes there's no way to, uh... Oh. I couldn't see him, but I knew he was coming. Sometimes there's no way to do a roll that catches both of the attacks in the iframes, and sometimes no time to get a second roll off as well. I'm not sure what he smashed, but whatever it is, there's pieces of it everywhere. Shield Bash is the easiest thing he does to dodge, as long as you're, you know, prepared for a dodge. That was worth it! Oh, I didn't see the second swing coming. See if I can... Oh, I thought message rating gave me an Estus. I don't know what it does in this game. <laughs> oh, no, no, it was uh, kindling a bonfire that gives an, gave an Estus in Dark Souls 1. I'm letting them get to well-timed with each other. Okay, I need to get the black one to swing first, and then the red one. Okay, I should have been more specific. I need the weapon to swing first. Because I really should not lose here unless I go making really big mistakes. Okay, there we go. Oh darn it, I took my other one off, didn't I? Oh good gracious, why was I not attacking you? You have half the health of the other one. And apparently no idea how to deal with enemies behind you. I don't know how that first one hit and missed me. I, my roll timing was so bad.
Well, shouldn't I get two Dragon Rider souls from that? Hurrah for victory. Hurrah for all the random gold. Bernhardt, don't tell me I could have summoned you. Oh, well met, friend. Good to see you well. Yes, very good indeed. I journeyed from the distant east to perfect my swordsmanship. And legend has it that powerful beings slumber in this land. A sword has been in my family for generations. And only a real man can wield it true. I may face any man or a man or beast, but none shall be a match for my sword. <laughs> this land is the right mess, eh? King's gone. The people have a mad glint in their eyes. The land itself is overrun by terrible beasts. No better place to test my sword, eh? <laughs> This land is the right Okay. That's that, and that's Bonfire. Maybe it's that one. Maybe it's that one, that one that he helps with. I don't know. I do have 64,000 souls. I real. He vanished. He vernished. He vernaled earnished. Let's go level up. That's right, I forgot I had to level up my strength. I'm gonna get it there. That's 60 more health. Ah, yes, pyromantic love. And my scimitar. You know what? I'm going to deposit some of these weapons. Short sword, great sword, great sword, line. That should help. Oh, goodness. I forgot. Uh, now it'll show us basically all the areas. And if you've missed a bonfire in an area, it will, such as that, show it to you. I don't know if I mentioned before the number on each bonfire is the new game cycle number. If you use a bonfire aesthetic, the number would go up by one. Uh, but yeah, I've missed a bonfire there. There's an area I haven't gotten. I mean, overall, done pretty good. I know that's the Smelter Demon bonfire. I mean, the uh, bonfire I hadn't gone through at Iron Keep. For reasons. For many... Nearly useless Trump's empty-handed. Uh, okay, that's where that boss was. Let's go see if... Oh, that's what they were brusting up, those statues. Oh, imagine if those turned into little gargoyles during the fight and you had to deal with just... Uh, gank squad bosses are not a good plan. Just don't overuse them. I don't like being over 50% capacity either. But every time I take off the shield, I come across an enemy that I really needed the shield for. Yeah, there's two paths from here. One should lead me to an elevator I can't use yet. Hooray! And a door I can't open. And a lever I can't pull. This is the room of Cant. And this is a ladder in the room of Cant. And I can climb the ladder. This ladder is clearly broken. And any object in the room of can't should be can't usable.
Oh, Phantom. Uh, I don't remember this room at all. I don't like this. Boop. Boop. They're all gonna come to life. I just know it. Well, excuse you! See if there's one of those over here. Watch, there's an invisible hollow somewhere and I must find them. Nope, okay. This room makes me nervous. Mannequins! Case in point for shield. Them and their crazy throwing knives. Aha! And watch him turning the thing is just gonna activate all the statues. Wait, does he not have... Oh, never mind. The legs are just behind the thing. Oh, that's what brings the elevator down. Okay, and it did not attack the statue. I mean, it did not trigger the statues to all turn into uh, murder machines. That's also nice. The mannequins being here was a new thing. Well, so was that room. So were the statues in the room, at least. Katha's Chime and Soul Great Soul. Hex Dedicated Catalyst cannot be used to cast miracles. Uh, and what was the other thing? Old Night Hammer. Oh. They're, uh... They're very good, but they have very low durability. I mean, if you're using those weapons, obviously. It wouldn't be much use to me. I'll have the strength to wield it. That's new! And it sees me. You don't see me. What you gonna do about it? Huh? Huh? Kinda figured it would suddenly break down the wall to get to me. No, this room usually had two mammoths in it, which was a right nuisance. Lucky for me, collision. Ow, it went through the wall. Ow. Lesson learned. I, was, I thought it bounced off of collisionable stuff. I should not have used the last of my stamina on that. I'm not being nearly careful enough. Why am I behind a horse? Never, never attack behind a horse. They will kick. I think I broke the AI. Get out from behind the horse! But they don't be in front of the horse either. In the room I go. Can you hold still? Trying to shoot you. I pull out a bow and it just starts running. 
What kind of whacked out demon horse are you? I'm behind a wall. I know when I'm... I know when it's smart to run. Okay, that's enough messing around. Ring... I don't remember that. Ring of the Assassin Gower, Half Dozen Kings, reduces damage taken from behind. Huh. Oh, the anti-backstab ring. I didn't know you could find that here. Oh no, don't go up the stairs. Hello. I'm not here. You're not supposed to be here either. I'll take you over the mammoths at least. There. No, you're not. Okay, I'm out. See ya. There's normally four uh, big great bow guys hanging out up there, and they're a pain to deal with because while you're fighting one, the other three are shooting you. I'm gonna go through this door that you can't follow. What are you gonna do about it? Huh? 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 Wow, if I could aim, I'd be dangerous. Oh, that's right. Night Ultra Old Night Ultra Great Sword. Hmm. Well, in any case, now we can get up here. Aha! You almost got me. Run, 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 run. If you're right behind it when it lunges, you can get caught in it. It, it has a very big hitbox on that initial one. A washing pole and a petrified dragon bone. For those that don't know, the washing pole is a very long katana. Downside, it has low durability, and it weighs a lot. Uh, it has very good reach, though, which is good for a katana. You better not be a mimic. You don't have shiny lock eyes, so you're not a mimic. Firestorm. That's for the best that I can't jump over that. Let's see what's out here. A blood stain is out here, that's what. Oh wait, I remember what's out here. Not what I remembered being out here. There's one of the great, uh, great bow guys. 
There used to be like four of you. Where did you all go? Goodness. This door, I think, worked. I don't remember. But yeah, there used to... There was a lot of them up here. Oh, hello there. You, you were not a thing. You were not previously a thing. If, can I target lock you, please? Oh, you do a lot of damage, sir. Okay, don't use the power stance versus bosses. The time after swinging before you can roll is just so large. It's getting me caught. Oh, I thought that was a wind up for another swing. You, sir, will regret that. Aha, there's the third swing I was expecting. Uh, excuse me? Did I break it? I think I broke it. I really hope it wasn't supposed to drop an item. <sighs> I just imagine there's an item down deep at the bottom of the hole. This is a ho a bunch of a bunch of a What I was saying was this is a safe room, but it's full of ghosts and boom boom, fireball, explosions. Hmm. Just gonna let my stamina come back and pop, pop, pop. It has a faster firing speed than the, uh, regular bow. And she apparently can't hit me from here. You're only gonna get three shots off with the basic 120 stamina, though. I hear you, ghost. You can wait your turn. Missed me. Okay, if I would quit hitting a wall, I wouldn't have missed you, but anyway, we'll, we'll roll with that. Yay, a skirt! Just what I needed. Yay, gloves! What are they? Those are actually pretty rare drops. What are the odds they would drop two of their equipment set? It increases intelligence. I mean, it's a pretty good set. Lots of ballistas. And I'm afraid they're gonna fire. Move, move, move. Okay. I figured with my luck, as soon as I pulled the lever, all the ballistas in the room would fire. Hmm. This is far easier than it should be. And oh look, we ran a loop back to the bonfire. Okay, well that's a that loop de loop's been looped. Floop de loop. Up we go. Into the Tower of Terror. Ooh. Uh, I don't know anymore. I really like that warped sword, it's pretty. Uh, 
any day now. There we go. Now we hit the top of the staircase. Ladder. Elevator. Hello, imprisoned. I mean, embedded. Hello, last Milfano. We'll be back for you. I think it's Milfano. I forget. Soul vessel and a fire seed. Soul vessels are for respecting your stat points. Always a useful thing. Key to King's Passage. Oh, the embedded you poor soul. Strong magic shield. And no, you can't kill it. I don't think you can kill it. You need a key. It, it just treat it like a locked door and don't ask questions. Even though I can still hear it moaning. Key to the King's Passage. Oh, hello, fog wall I'm not looking forward to. What do we do here? That's... <laughs> An alluring skull. Ah, okay, so there's a thing here. Oh, fun fact, if you destroy them before they get up, they don't drop souls. Oh, crud, and they all... Uh, that's new. Yeah, just so you know, they're Twin Blade users. And they're normally one at a time, Twin Blade users. You don't want to deal with more than one of them at a time. And I didn't even know you could backstab them. That's good information. Generally, they are a nuisance to fight. You got me. Oh, yeah, that's the attack one of the attacks I was looking for. What's hitting me? Was he kicking me? Was he trying to kick, kick, kick me? Life gem. Petrified something. Snow. Okay, there is something to be said about the upcoming boss. And the fact I have zero estuses. I didn't rest at the bonfire. Uh, the upcoming boss is unique in that it's an invadable boss. Uh, namely, the boss will try to summon people. If you use red cracked eye orbs or the red summon soapstone here, uh the boss can summon you to invade the player that's trying to fight the boss. There are also a number of NPC summons that it can pull through, but uh, this makes it a popular place for people to invade players trying to fight a boss. I'm going to go ahead and use these souls to level up, though. I'm not frozen. You're frozen. Is that a 
here oh, to see what I have. Shard. Get the shard. That's nine Estuses. And twenty more health. And we're back. Also, careful about sending the elevator up because you will forget that it's gone and walk into a pit. Or it's a mistake many people make by not paying enough attention. There we go. <laughs> I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die. <laughs> Nobody should have to deal with four of them doing that. Oh, and there's the big spinny attack. Stone twin blood. There we go. Castle stone soldier. Velstack could always be found at the king's hide and followed him where he fled. The knights in his service waited patiently for his return, but toned to, turned to stone before he did. Yeah, Velstat didn't return. He, uh. Well. King didn't return either, but. Long story. We will get there. Tight knife slab. Uh, that's that, that's a good item to have a lot of. Why? 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 Why did you swing the wrong way? Okay, in any case... I think Ben Hart is summonable here. That is not Ben Hart. Ben Hart, is this you? Ben Hart! I don't know why I'm wasting those. It's not like being one S to short is gonna save me. I mean, not like one S to short is gonna kill me. Can't help it. Anyway, onward. Onward. No, no, I thought there was a cutscene for him. Big guy, big shield. Lots of lightning. Uh, also, the shield is a physical object, even when he's not blocking with it, so you're gonna want to avoid hitting it. And if Ben Hart dies, then it doesn't count towards the uh, the thing I'm trying to do. The no. Ah, I messed that one up. There is actually a ring you can wear that will make enemies pay more attention to you that you can use to keep a boss's aggro on you. It's great for if you're doing co-op and you want to uh, keep a boss distracted for somebody or for doing this. Have I done any damage to him yet? That hit didn't hit me, but okay. Oh, oh. No, oh, no, I don't know if that's a player or not. I'm hoping it's not.
Ben Hart. No, you must live. Yes, pay attention to me. I am I am the one you want. Stop focusing, Ben Hart. No. No. Run, Ben Hart. Leave Ben Hart alone. I'm gonna be honest, I really don't like the whole they have to survive the fight part sometimes. But it's a nice touch. Uh, but yes, I will be doing that again. Hmm. I'm actually going to... See if my rapier does any better damage. Since I can uh, poke without hitting the shield, that may help. Also, okay, so that's a thing. Ah, uh, I was doing some quick reading. Surprisingly enough, although he uses lightning damage and his armor is lightning resistant, I forgot that because you're standing in the rain, uh, when you're wet, your fire resistance goes up and your lightning resistance goes down, and apparently it's... Uh, a lot of people are saying that he does take a lot of damage from lightning, so I'm just going to lightning... Use the lightning resin on my weapon. So poor Bernhardt can survive. And yeah, if you defeat them as is, they head falls off and you get no souls, no item, etc. Time to run. Not dealing with three of you. I'm going to jump cut over most of this. Okay, let's try this again. I'm going to try a lightning rapier. Actually, I'm going to poke him with the rapier first, just to be sure. No, nah, actually, I'm... Oh, good, it still took effect. Oh, that was completely my own ti timing. I think I can verify, he don't like being poked, or being poked by lightning. And I cannot time, I, I get the, the direction of the spin backwards. I, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be downright honest, I keep getting the direction backwards. I can at least hit him a lot more reliably with the rapier. And... Oh, no, that's not the spin. Okay, focus him. Oh, he seems to have a lot of defenses when he's doing that. Okay, I think that's a uh, NPC phantom. I think the uh, when he actually summons a player, they turn red. As would a normal invader. Ooh, thank you, Bernhardt. Okay. Uh, also, as a uh, slight bit of advice for would-be invaders, Rain inflicts the wet status. I have read that a lot of invaders want to use pyromancy in here. Wet status gives a massive boost to fire resist and a reduction to lightning resist. 
do with that information as you see fit. But, now we open this chest and... Spellforts ring, plus two, that's nice. Spell resistance, magic resistance. Now that is a beautiful scenery. But that is beautiful scenery, not a beaut- You know what I mean. Anyway. Elevator! I am rambling today. I'm rambling it up in spaces, rambling it up in here. Rambling it up over there, and over there, and under there, and up there. I can't remember if that's two or three boss fights I've got. No, I think that's just two I've gotten Ben Hart for. I don't remember at this point. I lost track. Oh no, we're already here? I thought this was later. You're new. You're not. I remember you. You and your green blossom. I'm going to accept the gift of fire and bring it with me, just in case. Oh, that's me in the water. Okay. I heard noise. I cringe. Oh, well, that was a waste. Shrine of a mana. I did not think we would... I didn't think we were at this area yet. This is both a loved and a hated area for various reasons, but it really is beautiful. As you can see, we're going that away, then that way. But, I think this episode has run long enough, so I am going to level up. Almost to the max health. Or almost to the max health that I will be achieving. Excuse me. Anyway, in any case, like I said before, well, like I started to say before, I'm gonna go ahead and pause here, and I will see you next time.